Uh, many of you will remember that we had um, a problem with the ozone going away, which has been sort of solved, um, but we also know and realize now that stratospheric ozone is actually influencing regional climate change. We ask to answer questions that are linked to major environmental challenges, such as what's the effect of global change on natural services, water quality, habitat species. Every day, 4,000 Europeans die of cancer, three every minute. To reduce this number to zero is a big challenge that can only be addressed by innovative solutions to be developed in an international interdisciplinary collaborative effort. I don't have access to similar research to mine that is being published by other researchers and thus many times I have to duplicate the research of other people in order to produce the data set. We are working with Earth observation satellite data in order to understand global environmental processes and how climate change is infecting our environment. The main challenge is that our data are becoming more and more complex and the, the volume of our data sets become more and more larger. It is becoming increasingly difficult to manage data created at high brilliance facilities. Large data volumes are difficult to manage from the perspective of both individual user groups and of the facilities themselves. We generate enormous amount of data when we simulate the proteins that are mutated in cancer. After we do the simulation, we have the potential to analyze them and discover new candidate drugs. After that, we publish our research, but unfortunately, there are no open repositories that we can deposit these datasets so that other scientists can analyze the research. So searching uh, for and sifting through literature um, in the different disciplines can be very challenging even if the technologies used in the two disciplines are similar. ELSC can help me store my data, it can help me manage it, analyze it, and most importantly, to share it with other researchers. The European Open Science Cloud can help ecological data intensive research uh, to be most successful by making available large amounts of datasets and new types of data, code and methods that go beyond the field-based scale studies in time and space. The ability to deliver data and data services via a common portal with federated authentication will be a real benefit for all research infrastructures. This will enable improvements in data management and increasing the use of fair data will benefit both facilities and facility users. The EOS would offer cultural heritage institutions a platform for sharing collections-based data, which would enable um, epidemiological studies that could either be related to ultramarine disease or any other degradation phenomenon or conditions-based inquiry. And I think that this uh, would facilitate improved care for the cultural heritage worldwide. It will combine a lot of uh, often complicated uh, tools in a single working environment and then bring together people who are working on uh, separate projects uh, by all directing the effort into a common uh, solution. EOSC will help to drive open science and to uh, facilitate open access by promoting the cooperation uh, between all the open data infrastructure. With EOSC and with more open data available, we will be able to transform big data into better health. EOSC will enable the reuse of data so that science will become open, data will be open, and this will impact the lives of citizens because we will be able to create more products more efficiently from the time and cost benefit.
The European Open Science Cloud will enable and drive FAIR principles. From the FAIR perspective, Interoperable enables interdisciplinary research, allowing users from one area to access and use data from another, and in many cases analyse multiple data sets from different domains together. This capability adds scientific value and enables discovery. EOSC can boost interdisciplinary research in Europe by encouraging sharing and safeguarding fair research data across all disciplines. And this will assist in the validation of data and also accelerate uh, innovation by improving both the use and reuse of data in the future through the mitigation of data loss. The way we do science is changing, and the scientific method itself is demanding more transparency and accountability of research. One way to go towards these changes is um, to make our research more reproducible, especially more computational reproducible, and the EOS can help us uh, in this process. Data become the more valuable the more people work with the one and the same data set. And the same applies for the software. From data to knowledge is our motto.